Festival, and I'm here with one of the headliners of the night, Kat Raquel. How are you doing? I feel great. Just got off stage, full of energy. I feel great. Well, I was back here while you were upstage, and I was feeling it all the way back here. I'm like, who is that up there tearing it up? That's in the nice curly hair. I normally have mine now. I have it in a bun today, but it looks beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank well, you. How do you feel about your performance? I thought it was great. You know, it really, for me, it's about feeding off the energy from the crowd. And I felt like they were into it, so that helped me to get into it, get into my zone. So getting on stage, reflecting, I'm like, I feel great. I feel great. Okay, so tell me a little bit about your musical style and how did you get started in music? So I've been singing forever. I started in the church. My parents are gospel singers, so that's kind of how I got started. And um, I'm a songwriter. I'm assigned to BMG Music Publishing. So I've been writing songs for a lot of other people. And right now, as I said on stage, it's amazing to actually be doing my own thing, you know? So I'm working on an EP produced by Boot of the Future and Grand's Music. And it's like an eclectic blend of soul and hip hop and R&B and pop and it's just dope and I'm really excited about it. Well how do you find inspiration? What inspires you for the songs that you write? Not only for yourself but for other artists as well. Well it's easier when you're writing for other artists because they kind of have a specific sound or you know what I mean they might come with an idea. Um, but for me I usually just put the track on and just go you know and all of my stuff is about life experiences my own or people close to me so I like to do music with messages That's nice. so what are some of your favorite songs that you've done my own oh that's hard um, all the ones I did tonight um, so I have a single coming out the top of 2015 it's called um, die trying I'm sorry die trying is coming out in a couple weeks that's gonna be a free download so living free is the actual official single that's dropping the top of 2015 and that's one of my favorites pushing which is already out you know you can download that for free that's one of my favorites revenge it's just a lot of them okay, and how do you feel about these type of showcases that give artists a chance to share their work sh um, showcase it to other artists and the networking aspect how do you feel about this? I think it's really important you know I think um, especially with the independent artists kind of doing their own thing right now I think it's really important for artists to have outlets you know when it's not just a major label situation you know where we can come and we can perform you know we can grow our following so I think it's a really great event you know and especially for artists like myself it's great. well thank you it was very nice speaking to you. you did a great job tonight can you tell us where we can find your music yes you can find my music um, on my site which is www.catrockell.com that's k-a-t-t-r-o-c-k-e-l-l -L. I want you to get that right and um, you can follow me using at Cat Raquel online. Well, thank you. Hope you have a good night.